Baron, what are you doing? I am getting ready to make my safer Torah. This is the cloth. I have to put on the, the tops on each one and the bottoms. And I thank Izzy Katz for, and I thank Sharon Pfeiffer for uh, donating my the top of my Rimonim. What are Rimonim? Rimonim are the silver that adorn the beautiful Sefer Torah, and I got magnificent fabric. Wow. And it's gonna look really, really nice. Okay, I was able to put on the discs, except I don't have any hot glue, and there's nobody around to help me hot glue it, so I'm trying with tape. I hope that works. I have these two things that look like ice cream cones. They're going to be Rimonim for our beautiful Sefer Torah. I did very, very well with the Sefer Torah. That looks pretty good, right? Today I'm going to decorate the meal so it looks like really, really nice, but not so nice because this Sefer Torah is 200 years old. Next, I try to make bells that come on top of the, um, on top of the Sefer Torah. I did my best. Somehow, it didn't get the shape that I really wanted. It sort of looks like a pulky, right? A silver pulky. I even put like a little string on them. But, oh my gosh, this is terrible. Then Batsy came home and she said, oh, you need to make Rimoni Mima? Okay, here, I'll start you off. And she made this. It actually works. I'm making the bells for the sacred Torah. Who's helping me? My dear husband <laughs> and my fantastic daughter. Thank you. This is a family project. Yeah! Silicon maintenance. Exactly. Silicon engineer. Yeah, it looks like it really goes there. Thanks to everybody who helped create this beautiful Sefer Torah and these wonderful Rimonim. And if you've been watching this adventure, you are entitled to enter a raffle for two free tickets to Hidden, the Secret Jews of Spain, with the answer to these two questions. Number one, what is the meaning of the writing on the outside of the Sefer Torah? And number two, what did my son, the Sofer, write inside the Torah? Send your responses to wpc.jerusalem at gmail.com. And before Shabbat of this week, we will choose a winner. Good luck.